Hey guys, uh, really quick video, lightning fast video. I just wanted to say that one of my favorite things in OpenBSD, and I, I think this is one of the coolest things that has come out of FreeBSD, uh, OpenBSD rather, is uh, is Duas. Like why, why aren't why aren't we all using Duas instead of sudo? I don't understand. You know, when you um, if you're coming over from Linux, you'll know this as well. Um, you know, in order to use uh, to run a program um, with root privileges, you you do your sudo. Um, but I don't know, depending on what if you're in Linux, you might sudo apt-get or sudo pacman. Um, and before you can do that, you've got to you've got to log in as as root, and then um, you know, and then you have to uh, you've got to v sudo, and you've got to edit that file um, to give users or groups permission to use sudo. Um, do as is way easier. Do as, like if I, like let's say I want to look at my root directory as a user, I can't do it, right? It's it's blocked, but if I do as ls slash root, by default do as uh, means do as root, like do, do this as root. So I'm able to run um, root level commands just by, by whacking do as on the, on the beginning of it. And it's super easy, like if you look at, um, I'll show you. This is the config file. Like when you install, uh, to to install it on FreeBSD, it's just pkg install do as, um, or sudo pkg install do as. Um, once you do, you just edit the do as config file. And if you're like me and you're just you're the only user on your system, you can just um, uh, you can either whack your own username in there, um, or or wheel as long as you're part of that group. Um, or, and, and here's the OpenBSD uh, man file for it. Um, you can actually do a few different options. There's, um, so I've got, I've got mindset to no pass, which means if I ever run do as and a command, it'll just run and it won't, it won't ask me for a password. If, I, if you put persist, if I put persist here instead of no pass, it will, um, it will ask me, it'll be like sudo. It'll ask me for a password once and then it will remember for a while. Um, so if you want to, if you want to like a little bit of extra security, if if other people are around, um, uh, keep environment means that um, even though I'm running a command as root, I'm keeping the environment of my user, and or you can set environment. You can, um, what else can you do? You can you can use um, CMD. So you can stipulate which programs that person can do. So like if I wanted to, I could actually. Um, you know, I could do, uh, I won't type it in here, you could just do permit no pass, um, and you could have CMD LS, say for example. So I'm only allowed to use that uh, do, as, do as LS, but nothing else. Um, so I, I don't know, I just think it's really simple, and it's really, it's, it's simplified, but it's really, um, it's really intuitive, and it's, um, it's probably one of my favorite little carryovers from OpenBSD. And I, I think there is a, a Linux port for this. Um, obviously, it works on FreeBSD, which is what I'm using here. Um, yeah, so um, thank you, OpenBSD community.